Hi guys, so I am here today with swatches for you. Lip swatches. Oh, look at this dance. So I have to explain something first. I know you guys were probably, some of you were expecting nails. I have a little story for you. If you don't want to hear the story, just fast forward like a minute or two. So I filmed 80% of the nail tutorial and the past two days I've just been in a serious funk. I don't know why. Nothing bad happens in my life. Everything is still the same as it always is. I just have been feeling very bummy. Like yesterday I laid in bed for probably four to five hours. I never, I never even sit down for five minutes unless I'm filming. So I don't know. I just have been a little bit down. I feel a lot better today. I feel like I'm pretty much back to my weird, stupid, crazy self. But the thought Honestly, I'm just going to be honest with you guys. The thought of doing nails right now, it's just not sitting with me. I just, it's not in me today. Oh God, let me shut my phone off. Mom, you're going to have to wait. It's just not in me right now. And if I'm not feeling something, I can't film it. You guys will totally be able to tell that something's wrong that I'm not feeling it. So I wanted to get something up for you guys today and a lot of you have asked me to swatch some of the new liquid lipsticks that I've recently purchased. So I thought that would be a super easy video to like ease me back into filming. I don't know what's been up with me the past two days. Totally did not feel like myself. I almost thought that I was getting sick but I feel a lot better today. So anyway, I'm not asking for pity. I just wanted to explain to you guys, the nails will be up tomorrow. I'm gonna finish it up in the morning, edit and get it up for you guys. And the following day, the Essie Summer Collection review will finally be up. I know I told you guys that was gonna be up a long time ago. I'm sorry, just bear with me. So okay, today we are doing some lip swatches. I have some new LA Splash um, liquid lipsticks and I also have some from Colored Rain. So I know a lot of you said that you were waiting to order till you saw my swatches so I'm like okay I better get this up for them. So I'm gonna start with the LA Splash ones. I don't know what the difference is with the ones that I have. Like some of them have pink lids, some of them have silver lids, and one of them has a gold lid. I mean they are called different things but honestly they all feel and look like formula wise exactly the same so if that was something that you were kind of worried about in my opinion they're all just liquid lipsticks so i'm gonna start with the pink guys the first one is what i'm wearing and this is my favorite one out of everything that you're gonna see today this is so pretty this is charmed you guys look at that it's just like so wearable but it still has that like gray undertone that I love any lip color with a gray undertone I need it I I need like three of them I have a problem so again this is charmed my hand is gonna be so stained with swatches but it's worth it okay so there she is oh my god you guys if you like nude like nudie pink if you like lip colors that I like, you will die for this. You need it. Oh, it's so gorgeous. Now, a lot of you were asking me about the formula of these. In my opinion, the LA Splash and the Colored Rain feel very, very similar. They're both liquid lipsticks. I feel like they're both kind of drying, but worth it. I mean, the prices are pretty good on them. The colors are very nice. I would say unique a lot of them some you can definitely find dupes but I definitely think they're worth the money I feel like I'm very sensitive when it comes to liquid lipsticks like I'll hear other people say oh that's not drying at all and I'm like over here feeling like the Sahara so I think it's all about personal preference but in my opinion both of these brands are worth the money so the next one that I have is Love Good. This one's a lot deeper and more like reddish. Oh, it's really pretty. I usually don't go for like a brown lip. I feel like this one's like a reddish brown. Really pretty, right? Yeah. And then the other one I had, did I just make that noise? That I don't even know how I did that. 
This other one is Nymph Adora. Nymph Adora. That's a weird name. Let me swatch it right beside Love Good so you can see the difference. So that's Love Good. It's definitely more red. And then Nymph Adora is more deep, like a deeper, like brownish red. Yeah. Hmm. Isn't Charm the best, right? I know some people are like, no, that's the best. Charmed is definitely the best in my book. And my book is all that matters. No, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. Oh my God, people will attack. Okay, the next two I have. Oh, and by the way, did I tell you what they were even called? The pink lids, the three that I just swatched for you, are the Smitten Lip Tint Waterproof Mousse. Again, I think all of the lids like all of them pretty much are the same thing, but anyway. Okay, so the next two are called the Studio Shine Lip Lusters. These are just basic liquid lipsticks. So the first one is Nala. This one's a pretty nude shade. Let's put it right here. Right? It's like a peachy nude. I haven't worn this one yet, but I do think it's really pretty. It'll probably be the next one that I dive into. I just want to wear Charmed every day. It's so pretty. And then this other one is Belle. We'll put her right, but I got to do it this way or I'm going to make a mess. This one's a lot deeper and more like mauve maybe? mauve brown? I feel like everything has brown in it today. My eyes are deceiving me. So those are the first five Charmed is still my favorite. Okay, and then the other one I have is called Lip Couture Waterproof Liquid Lipstick. Wait, I feel, oh, I have two of these. I was gonna say, I know I have two of these. The one is OG Ghoulish, and the other one is Ghoulish. So I'm assuming they had like an original one, and then they have like an updated version. So the first one I'm gonna show you is OG Ghoulish. These are similar, but you'll be able to see the difference. Oh my God, I love this color so freaking much. Look at that. I'm telling you, the gray lips just do something to me. I mean, that's like really gray. It's definitely not for the faint of heart, but so, so stinking pretty. And then just ghoulish, oh gosh, this one is just ghoulish, if you didn't hear that over the lippy falling. I think I like this one better. This one has like a, well you can see, the OG one is a lot more gray. This guy has a lot more like mauve to it. I think it's definitely more wearable. Can you guys see that? Oh man, they're so nice. I just want to like slather them all over my bod. Freaking Gorgina! Okay, so that is it for the, whoa, that's it for the LA Splash. Get them out of the way. I'm just so noisy. So I have four of the Colored Rain lipsticks and these are, son of a bitch. These are just called, I don't even know what they're called. It just says Colored Rain. It's just their basic liquid lippies. So the first one is Marshmallow. This one is, oh gosh, so, so, so pretty. This one looks a lot like OG ghoulish in my opinion. So there's OG right here and then here's Marshmallow. This one looks a little bit more purple when it's on your lips, like it has that purple undertone to it. And the reason I'm not swatching these on my lips is because my lips would be freaking destroyed. I will have the hardest time getting these off of my hand. So apologies for not putting them on my lips. But whenever I wear one of them, I will put a picture on Instagram. I know that's not much of a help but hopefully it'll be something. Okay, the next one is Soul. I almost wore this one today. I'll put it right beside Marshmallow. And by the way, I hate Marshmallow. Did you guys know that about me? So this one, Soul, is very, very deep. I mean, really deep, but on, it's such a neat, unique shade. The whole like cashmere, you know, there's so many dupes out right now for cashmere. I feel like this one is totally different. Like it's a lot deeper. 
but so good. Oh. And then the last two I have are the lighter shades. This one is Mars. This is a really, really pretty shade. I guess it's not that light. It's a unique shade though because it's like deep, but it still has like that mauve to it, but it has a little bit of brown in there. It's a really, really nice shade when you have it on. Mm, yeah, I approve. I really like that color. Gorgina. And then the last one I have is Sugar. This is probably my favorite one just because it's like the nude of the bunch. Oh, it's so pretty. That was a bad spot. Let me put it up here. You know what? Let me put it on the inside because I'm lighter in here so it shows up a little better. Sue. Did I just say Sue? There you go. There's Sugar. Look at that. Oh my goodness. I need to scrub this tanner off really really nice nude there is a nude that i like better though we're gonna get to it in a second i'm gonna just slip in my dose of colors the four that i have just while i'm doing this i might as well so those are the colored rain ones that i have i only have four of them and i did them all yes i did i had to do a double take so now i'm going to show you guys my four dose of colors Three of them, the first three I swatch for you, are from their Terra collection. So you can get these three in a set. If there's only one that you want, word on the street is they're coming out with individuals. So like if you only want this guy. So just hold out and I'm sure they'll be available separate very soon. My camera keeps shutting off. This first one is Stone. Did I wear this one? Yes, this is the one that I wear a lot. Oh my God, you guys, this is so pretty. Look at that. Oh, I love it. I love it. Oh, that was like a porn moon, wasn't it? Oh, but it's so good. It's gorgeous. I still like Charmed a little bit more right here, but this one is very close. They're very, very similar. I feel like Charmed is a little bit more pink. Yeah, just they're so freaking gorgeous I can't even stand myself the next one is where is she brick and this is a really nice like deep red picture that in the fall with like a really smoky eye oh yes mm-hmm mama approves should I just shut up and swatch I feel like my commentary is so not necessary but hey it's my channel right I guess. Okay, this next one is Sand. This is the nude that I was talking about. This nude, I'll put it in here again so you guys can see it. It's a true nude. There's no pink in it. There's no peach in it. It's a straight up nude and I love it. If you are a fan of nude lips, like I am, like the really light concealer nudes, you need this. Oh, you need it like right now. Just pause this video and go order it. And then the last one I have from Dose of Colors is Bury Me. This one I got at IMATS. Oh wait, I'll put it over here. Oh my goodness, I'm gonna have a hell of a time getting these swatches off. So pretty, I love this shade. I've worn this probably like six times and that's a lot for me with a darker shade. I like that it still keeps the pink like when you put this on, it doesn't just turn into this like deep reddish shade. It keeps the pink and it's so pretty on. <gasps> I think I wore this to, I wore it to something when I was in LA. I can't remember what though. But yep, that's it. These are my swatches. So these are the LA Splash Colored Rain and Dose of Colors that I own. I feel like these are like the most popular shades so I can't believe I don't have any like bright pinks. I was really in like a drab mood when I ordered all of these. So yeah, some of them are very similar, but you can base your choices off of the swatches. Um, I hope this helped you guys. I hope this video wasn't totally pointless. A lot of you said you wanted the swatch video, so there you go um, as far as formulation goes on both actually all three of them i feel like the dose of colors are the the non wait what am i trying to say i i like the dose of colors ones the best they don't dry my lips out 
as much as the other two. The Colored Rain and the LA Splash, I feel like they're both drying, but I to this day have not found a liquid lipstick that doesn't dry my lips out. So I feel like they're drying, but I feel like it's totally worth it. I mean, they last forever. You put them on in the morning, you will be scrubbing them off at 10 o'clock at night with an oil-based remover. Like they do not move. So that's a really good thing, I think. I mean, I think that's why people wear liquid lipsticks because they're super long wearing. So definitely all three brands I showed you today worth it. Go buy them, pick out your colors, you'll be happy. Wow, that was a really long-winded explanation. So yeah, I love you guys. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you all tomorrow with nails. These nails right here. Okay, bye. Oh, oh, do you hear that? Are you a serial killer? Possibly. Oh, Houston, we have a mother cranking problem. <coughs> anyway, um, so yeah, that's it for these lip swatches. Oh, what? Wait, are we in focus? <laughs> oh, this lip color is so pretty. Oh my god, I just want to punch somebody in the face, like, repeatedly, and then smash their head off the curb. <sighs> this is so brutal. So I really hope... Whoa, too happy. It just overwhelms my body sometimes. It's like Camotopia. I don't know why... Wait, what? I don't know why. I don't know why. I love you like I do. I don't know why. I just do. Boom, boom. Look at this. Feast your dirty little eyes on Birthday Girl. This is a ColourPop limited edition packaging and shade. Should I swatch it for you guys? First swatch. Oh my god, it's so sad to have to touch it. <gasps> That's Gorgina. How many times do I say Gorgina in this video? Oh, hell to the yes. On the worst part of my body. Look at that. That's disgusting. Get a, get a scrubber. Get a loofah. Don't tell me what to do, you dirty bitch. Can somebody go get mommy a drink? Mommy is thirsty. The vodka's in the freezer. I don't even drink. But don't. I don't drink. I just don't like it. Don't like it. Not interested. I'd rather have some peach tea and a bag of candy. That sounded dirty. Bag of candy like a bag of cocaine. Are you serious? Your eyes do look amazing now. I forgot what I was about to say. <laughs> no, 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 they got me on Santa. I'm the lyrical gangster. Excuse me, Mr. Officer. Look at that. Now that, oh, oh, muscle man. Now that that's dry, look how pretty it is. Oh, don't you just want to like, oh, just rub it. Let me lick you up and down till you stay. Oh, listen to this story. I went to my mom's today and she told me that some boy walking home from school tried to pee on her tree. And my mom was like, no, 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 not on my tree. And the boy was like, I'm just modeling. And my mom was like, you go model somewhere else. I'm like, you tell him, mom. You tell them, dirty kids. Who just whips out their weenie and pees midday, 2.30? You better piss at home. That is disgusting. Where is your mother? I am such an old woman. Oh, you guys, my highlighter, if anybody cares, is Laura Geller as usual. She tweeted about my video and my love for this product. Like, go Laura Geller. Yeah. Me and you, girl. Oh, that was just, like, seductive. What are you going to do? Seduce Laura Geller into giving you a lifetime supply of gilded honey? I just might. Don't put it past Topaz. Tell me it's not. Like, you can't look at this lip color and say, eh, it's all right. You can't do it. Cannot do it. You're looking at this thinking, day um. Hot day um. Those lips is fly, right? High five. Give it up, girl. Psh. Son of a bitch.